Not a cloud in the sky right now in Warrensburg. As we look at top here of the high school, you can see the football field in the background. Sun starting to head for the horizon. Sunset tonight actually before 630. We're talking sunset at 618 this evening, going down earlier and earlier. We are in for a roller coaster ride temperature wise. We're going to talk about highs a little bit warmer tomorrow than what we saw today. We're back into the mid 70s. Average for this time of the year is 68. We quickly drop the highs back in the low 60s by Friday. A strong cold front is going to sweep across the area. No, we're not expecting anything in the way of precipitation with that boundary, but we will notice the cooler air rolling in by Saturday morning. Temperatures are all the way back into the mid 30s. It's going to be a frosty start to the day. Look at the high on Saturday, only up to 55. We're back to 60 on Sunday, then a warming trend again for the first part of next week. 70 Monday, 73 on Tuesday with another system coming in on Wednesday. This is the system, though, that holds a little promise for a little bit of rain. We're not expecting a whole lot out of it, but anything we could take at this point will definitely be welcome. A lot of the area now considered abnormally dry. The new drought index will be released uh, tomorrow and we'll show you what parts of central Illinois are still considered to be very, very dry. Frost is possible as well Saturday morning and on Sunday morning. Both mornings will start the day off in the low to mid 30s, but then those rain chances, like I said, come back during the day on Wednesday. Not a bad evening out there, is it? We're in the low 60s right now in Watsika and Danville, 67 in Champaign, Decatur, Mattoon, Shelbyville, all three of us at 68. It's 70 in Springfield and 71 degrees in Jacksonville, Vandalia. We are the warm spot at 73. You want the warmth? It's just off to our south. 86 still in Memphis, 87 degrees in Tulsa, Springfield, Missouri is at 80, 70 in Des Moines. A little bit cooler though, 55 in Detroit and 62 degrees in Chicago. Not a cloud in the sky, but it seemed just a couple of high clouds move through here. Earlier in the day, now the clouds are gone. We've got nothing but sunshine, and we can thank this to high pressure, which is anchored just off to our south across the Ozark Plateau, and also the area of high pressure extends all the way up into northern Missouri. As the high sags or pulls its way across central Illinois overnight tonight, clear sky, dry air, light breeze. Ideal conditions for radiational cooling. That means we don't have the blanket over the top of us to keep the warmth in, so it is allowed to escape out. So we'll see overnight lows tonight, dropping back in the low 40s. But here is the game changer. Notice tomorrow we start with a lot of sunshine. We'll see a mix of sun and clouds in the afternoon. Once the cold front rolls through here tomorrow, late afternoon into the evening, we're not expecting any precipitation, maybe a sprinkle or two in the Chicagoland area. But by Friday, that is when we're definitely going to tell a difference. We'll start the day off in the low to mid 40s. High pressure builds in during the day. Nothing but sunshine, but it is going to be a struggle to warm up. And then as the high settles right on top of us going into Saturday morning, that is when the really cool temperatures will start to arrive. We're expecting overnight lows again by Saturday morning back into the mid 30s. Areas in northern Illinois could be at or a little bit below freezing. Now what's going to cause all of this is that we've got a big deep dip here in the jet stream. We call this a trough. Cold air sinks in. We'll settle in here. Big strong Canadian high will be in the neighborhood. Very chilly again on Sunday morning. But finally, Sunday night into Monday, the cooler air is going to retreat back to the north. Warmer air will start to work back in for the day on Monday. We're back in the low 70s, mid 70s on Tuesday. But here comes the next system that will drive a cold front in here for the day on Wednesday and start to cool us down by the end of next week. Clear and cool overnight tonight. We're down to 43 for the overnight low out the road tomorrow morning. Grab the shades. Don't forget the jacket 43 at 7 a.m. 69 at lunchtime up to 75 for the high southwest winds 10 to 15. A gust to around 20 sunset tomorrow night is at 617. Your St. Mary's Hospital 7 day forecast low 60s on Friday. We're down to 33 by Saturday morning. Daytime highs on Saturday only in the mid 50s. 34 Sunday morning daytime highs around 60. We're back in the low 70s, even mid 70s possible by Tuesday. Thanks, JC. It seems like anyone can sue 